His Jeep went up in flames on a cold November night in 2008, torched at Van Winkle Elementary in Jackson, the last day anyone heard from 22-year-old Lester Cole. His body was found two days later. They murdered Lester and they took him back to the house and they took the truck and burned it. The trail went cold, no fresh leads. It's normally he would come by my barbershop and sit with me on a Thursday. Mm -hmm. And he didn't show that day that I, I text and I call and I didn't hear from him. Police were left with an unsolved murder on their hands. Do you think someone knows who this killer is? Yes, I'm sure. I'm sure. Looking at this case, I am positive that someone knows who done this. It happened at this house in Southwest Jackson, vacant at the time. The house Lester Cole grew up in. A missing persons case was filed. Tell me what happened that Thursday in order, in sequence. He told her that he had to go and meet somebody. He didn't say who it was. Names had been circulating around. Black male lying on his back with his face and wrist duct tape. <laughs> Cole was found lying on the floor. The cause, he was beaten to death, suffocated. Most troubling, his entire head and neck, even Cole's wrist, were bound in multiple layers of duct tape. What we're gonna do, we're gonna, we're gonna review the case from the beginning. What will lead to a killer? We were allowed limited access to investigative documents, but authorities refused to give us specific details, information only the killer would know. This is important, is it not right here? It's very important. So that's a clue. <laughs> His father could not hold back the tears as he revealed new clues. Lester Cole had been in the company of two high school friends that day. Sources tell us Cole got a call and left suddenly. Who was the last person to see your son alive? Um, his first cousin and another high school friend of his. Questions remain. Was Cole murdered? Then his body dumped back at his home. If so, why? So his family members could find the body? Or did the killers want to send a message? Was this duct tape murder linked to his friends? <coughs> Drugs? His father is convinced his only son knew his killers. It's very hard. It's very hard. You want his killers found? Yes. And? Prosecuted to the fullest. While dust may have gathered on this cold case file over the years, a killer is still roaming the streets. But the heat is on. Investigators ramp up their manhunt, knowing full well someone knows something. We're in the process of now trying to locate some other individuals that we need to talk with.